Hey there, welcome back to our channel. Today we are excited to take you on a virtual tour of our stay at the Fuji Speedway Hotel. This video is part 1 where we will be introducing you to this amazing place. Be sure to catch part 2, it will be upcoming video, where we dive into our delicious dinner and breakfast experience. Let me tell you a high level about the Fuji Speedway Hotel. Fuji Speedway Hotel is an unbound collection by Hyatt. Hotel located near the famous Fuji Speedway race track in Oyama, Japan. This hotel is perfect for race fans and travelers. It's offering a comfy room, great food, and cool car museum, and awesome views of Mount Fuji. It was the most unique hotel I have been in Japan, and Vinny loves cars, so it was a perfect place to visit for us. Anyway, now let's sit back, relax, and explore our fantastic time at the Fuji Speedway Hotel together. First, we arrive at the Mishima Station and rented a car from the JR Rent a Car Mishima. Hotel also provides a complimentary shuttle service from the Gotemba Station as well. But we'll be going to Nagano next day, so we decide to rent a car. This rental car place is right next to the station. I put a click link and car rental location name in the description. If you need for your travel, please reference it. We rented a Nissan Days and paid 188 USD for four days rental. That's around $47 a day. I personally really like this car because it's cute and also doors are automatically opening like a van style so I really like this car. Also make sure you always take a pictures or videos and tell them where the scratches are. Is this storage? It feels so weird sitting on the left side. Are you nervous? Are you okay? This is not openable? Oh. Even that one was wrong. Even that one was off. So I cannot go? I think I can. I don't know. Oh, shit. This is scary. It was my first time riding a right hand drive car, and seeing Vinny driving opposite was making me so nervous. And if you rent a car, make sure you always read this manual because it has a lot of critical information. On our way to hotel, we passed few tolls and paid it. Some places accept car and some places only accept cash. So make sure you carry cash. Coin or money, cash or car. After 40 minutes driving, we arrive at the Fuji Speedway Hotel. As soon as you walk into a hotel, you will see car museum. Later in the video, we'll be sharing the museum footage as well, so stay tuned for that. Vinny booked a special promotion anniversary gift per stay per room, so he was drawing for a room upgrade. So Vinny actually got a room upgrade for a deluxe room. He actually wanted it for a suite, but that's a big dream. But we are happy with our deluxe room. This hotel was opened in 2022 October. That's why it was an anniversary um, promotion packet we got it. And since it's a fairly new hotel, everything is a modern luxury looking.
In Japan, whenever I come to this hotel room, I like to see if toilet seat opens. This one did not surprisingly open automatically, but it looks great here. Especially, I like this closet room because it has a sliding glass door. I really love it. They offer slippers, socks, clothes, and bags. You can wear those slippers and clothes in and outside of your hotel room. For your information, you can take socks and bags to your home. However, slippers and clothes, you cannot take it home, but you can buy it from them as well. I kind of like the slipper and clothes, so I was gonna buy it, but it was a little bit pricey, so I did not buy it. I was a little bit surprised the bedroom and you can see the bathtub in here if you open the blind and you can of course close it but this is pretty unique and interesting. Since this is a deluxe room, the it is very spacious and I really like that especially the king bed. When you're in Japan, it's hard to get a king bed unless you really pay a lot. To match the racing car theme, they actually have a switch as a toggle switch for controlling your blinds and light switch. It's pretty unique. Feels like foie momo. Tastes kind of similar, but texture is very similar. It's just not made out of ghee, I think. Very similar to foie momo. similar to Guan Momo. Shiny musket. Shiny musket. I thought it called shine musket. I don't know, Korean called shine musket. a lot of stuff here. I know. Oh, because you can sit outside. I think that's why they offer these kind of things. Since we arrived around 5 p.m., we could not film this place during the day, so this is a night view. I know you can't really see much, so let me show you the morning view. Here we go! It is so beautiful. It reminds our trip to Las Vegas for Vinny's Corvette School. 
by the way i mentioned earlier and i put a link here as well if you want to see the corvette driving school how it looked like as well I think that's enough for the hotel room tour. Now let me give you a tour for this hotel. Let's start with the gym tour. It is pretty big. When we walked in, it's pretty big. There's a lot of equipment. We already see it. Um, they actually offered you this, I think it's hydration drink. We were very surprised about it. We actually took a couple, actually three of them for our road trip because we're gonna be thirsty so like oh let's take a vintage let's take that so we took it and the tasty and they have the body machine which i'm so scared of it always and you see these techno gym equipment i feel like no one using it but anyway that offers it i did not use it though Hold on, I need to tell you very important information about this racing simulator if you are interested about this. So they offer racing simulator but we could not try it because it requires a reservation and we did not know. If you want to do it, please make sure to reserve it in advance. Moving on to onsen and pool. I did not film those places for obvious reasons so I will just show you the stock photos. Onsen was very nice. It has a dry sauna, indoor and outdoor onsen. However, I could not see the Fuji Mountain sadly. It promotes you can see the Fuji Mountain when you're doing outdoor onsen, but I could not see it. The pool looks very good, but we did not use the pool because we're not a pool people. But I think if you love pool, that will be a place you can hang out for sure. After spa activities, you can drink tea, milk, or coffee milk from here. They actually offer in the spa area. This was pretty cool and I really love the coffee milk. the highlight of this Fuji Speedway Hotel, they do have a car museum. Um, I thought the car museum is actually included in hotel costs, but you actually have to pay separately. So please be aware of that. It's not that expensive. And I actually didn't go in, Vinny just went by himself since I'm not a huge car fan, but he would like to watch it so he take a video for us. So please enjoy. One of the interesting activities we've done in this hotel, they actually offers a e-bike for you to rent. It's actually, you cannot really drive very far, they say. You just hang out around the hotel, they say, and there's not a lot of place to go, but we still want to feel the breeze and ride an e-bike. So we went outside and we found a cute temple. So we just hang out there a little bit.
I actually do not film any souvenir shop, but this is car related and people may love these kind of things. So I just want to post it. They do have a lot of car related souvenirs and also Japanese themed stuff as well. So this is a great place to go. Even though you don't stay here, you can still visit the museum and get the souvenir. We also visit the Fuji Speedway track. You need to get a pass from the hotel lobby to enter. So make sure you talk to them. Entire my life, this was my first time seeing this many Porsches. This reminds me visiting the Corvette school in Las Vegas. Vinny completed his Corvette performance driving school there. If you love cars and interested, I'll put a link above. The track area has a places for you to eat and they sell souvenir as well and you can watch the actual race here. Unfortunately, we could not explore much since we had to rush to leave here to go Nagano. Fuji Speedway is a one place we definitely need to come back here to enjoy more activities and explore it. I hope you enjoyed our video and if yes, please give us a like button and subscribe to our channel because this helps us our channel a lot. In next video, we'll be sharing dinner and breakfast experience in Fuji Speedway Hotel. For the spoiler, the food was very good, so I want to create a separate video for you. Again, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye!